skadoodle. Your arm is now a noodle. Elite Smash. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another Road to Elite Smash. The last time we got in Pikachu, the electric rodent who really electrified the battlefield as he was quickly able to get the Elite Smash crown. Now, with Pikachu in, we only have seven characters left in our Road to Elite Smash series. And with our seven characters left, we only have just one character from one series that we have not got in yet. It's a series you haven't heard before, and it's the ARM series with Min Min as the character of choice for our Road to Elite Smash today. Now, Min Min is a really easy character, and I'm going to show you why Min Min is so easy. We're going to go up with this black alt. It has another black alt, but I prefer this one over that one. So let's go ahead and extend our reach. Well, it looks like we have a Sora up first, and let me say, it has been quite a long time since we've played against a Sora. So let's go ahead and go over Min Min's moveset. And as you can see, that's Min Min's up smash, which has a built-in reflector into it. Something it doesn't need, but it's going to be really, really helpful as it goes on. Alright, we're getting comboed a little bit so far, so... But the good thing is, with Min Min's up B, is not just sort of like a tether recovery, it's just recover. Oh no! Oh, missed it there, and unfortunately we're gonna die for that, but looks like Sora's gonna die for it too. What's up, bro? What, bro? What's up, bro? Take a swing, bro! Right here, bro! Alright, here we go. Now we're getting a nice hit off of that. That is Min Min's mega one. And there we go. The thing with Min Min's arms is you can attack with both at the same time, and accompany most of her moveset, actually. So let's go ahead and hopefully live that. Uh, unfortunately, one use down tilt to slide under Sora's back here, but looks like we're even. That's of course Mega Watt. Mega Watt. Mega Watt. Mega Watt. And that the second one is her Dragon Arm. Now I'll talk a little bit about her arms as the Road to Elite Smash goes on a little bit. Nice parry into that down smash. A nice last move. So let's go shield against Side B. What are you gonna do, big guy? Sit on me? <laughs> Don't tempt me. <laughs> But there we go, nice down air. That move is ridiculously good for no reason at all, and we were able to get a spike with it. And we haven't gotten a spike with down air in a pretty long time, so let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Alright, looks like we have Martha up next, and I want you to pay attention to Min Min's arms, as we're going to show you a lot of different properties of what Min Min's arms can do in this next match. So that is her Ram Run. That is the first arm that you normally get when you load up into the game as Min Min. So that is her back throw with her long arms, and... <laughs> Yeah, the thing with Min Min is that being an easy character, you know, you can just do stuff like that. Back throw, kill them at ridiculous percents. Alright, getting hit by the counter, not too good. Uh, oh, and unfortunately did jump in that forward air, oh, so... No! Min Min's arms are pretty long, but they aren't long enough to get back to the stage this time. So there we go. You can also move with Min Min's arms in the air. Mega a nice hit off of Megawatt. So let's go ahead and charge it. Oh, Alright, should have gone with the one two punch, but we do get a nice up smash. Well, real good for the question. What I'm using right there, I'm cycling pretty fast actually. Is there a down? Uh, okay. Well, that was not a smart idea to shield. And yeah, we're unfortunately gonna have to die to that. So, it's alright. We switched to Megawatt, and that is part of her down B actually. Alright, and this is her jab. Normally you just press jab once you just hit with one of her arms, that, with her dragon arm, which is the right arm. That's what her neutral attacks are. Her special attacks can be used with the push that Megawatt getting a nice shocking kill. We may not be playing Pikachu or Pichu anymore, but we can still bring some shocking surprises to the table with Min Min's Megawatt. And we're gonna show you the rest of her arms. Alright, looks like we have Mewtwo up next, and this is going to be a fun match to use that up smash in and reflect that Shadow Ball of Mewtwo's right back. Just got to be careful a little bit. So let's go ahead and start off with Ram Ram again. So Ram Ram goes in a bit of an interesting way, and it's really good for edge guarding. Ooh, okay, we almost got edge guarded ourselves, but we made it back, luckily living. Alright, and there we go. Almost getting him with that dragon arm. Hits him this time, though, and it looks like he's going back. So let's go for the Ram Ram. See, look at that. Hits him, in, and that weird an arc is really good for edge guarding. So let's go ahead. Now switch to Megawatt. It's really good for picking up kills as you've seen so far and shield against that Shadow Ball. Alright, making it back again. Not getting hit by it. And that's the thing. When you, when you press B in the air, you can just use the other arm for aerial attacks. Like that Megawatt is really huge. Unfortunately getting hit by that Shadow Ball. But already, Mimit is proving to be a, doing a nice job right now. And almost getting that reflected on the Shadow Ball. Just, YouTube is a little bit high. Do you ever look at someone and wonder, what is going on inside their head?
go. Awesome job getting that reflection on the Shadow Ball. Min Min's up smash. 56% off of that Shadow Ball. Let's see if we can finish him. Okay, that was unfortunately not going to happen. And yeah, Min, uh, you do actually is going to end guard us completely and we unfortunately aren't going to be able to make it back. But come on, imagine I hit that megawatt off of that. That would have been quite a way to end that game. Alright, and... Long before time had a name, the first Spinjitzu Master created Ninjago. There we go, awesome! We hit him with the megawatt, charging it up really fast and doing a ton of damage to Mewtwo, just deleting him instantly with that up smash and with that megawatt, doing a great job as always. Alright, looks like for our final match, we're going to be up against Sephiroth, and that is really good. I do like another light character for Min Min's Megawatt to go insane on. And of course, Ram Ram and Dragon Arm are going to be helpful as well for uh, edge guarding Sephiroth. And we do have a Shadow Flare on us, wanting to get that up smash to reflect it. And of course, if we get the chance, which I would really like soon, as we get that nice back throw, almost get him with the Megawatt, and we get a nice free down smash, getting him off the Octa Slash is if we get it into counter, we can reflect this counter because it is a reflectable projectile, which, which can be really nice. So yeah, I haven't talked too much about Dragon Arm, and I do want to get that really soon. Nice back throw, and there we go. Just Dragon Arm, you saw it with Mark too, shuffling it once again. We're not getting shield broken this time, luckily. All right, living that down smash just barely... Oh, oops, that's unfortunately my bad. I did try to down air to get safe, but I was unfortunately facing the other way, so it didn't really help us out that too much. But 15% from that megawatt is doing really good stuff right now. And getting that multi jab off of Min Min. Missed a little, but it's alright. We're living at 169. Nice job. Nice reflection again. Uh, unfortunate. I guess he was trying to bait us out with those flares, and trying to get me to reflect them. We do get a nice hit with megawatt. And that's the thing. Luffy, we haven't talked about too much yet, but let's go ahead over a nice back throw to kill. Ah, he does live, but luckily we have the dragon arm to- Oh my goodness! <laughs> Finish him off just like that. And one last note to to do is that if you use Uppy on the ground, you'll be able to jump up just like that and cover up so much just in order to get that Elite Smash crown. Well, I gotta say, the chances of Min Min getting her Elite Smash crown today were about this much and if you can't see it because the, my arms are so wide and Min Min's arms are so wide and covering so much range against her opponents today no matter which arm she chose whether it was ram ram dragon arm or megawatt just killing them really really early and proving that Min Min is a lot easier to play than a lot of people think well thank you guys so much for watching make sure to leave a like down below and megawatt that subscribe button and i will see you guys in the next video and until then, peace out and make it a great day, everyone.